Hi guys, this is Sadek from Robin.com. In this video, we'll show you how to pass a strong test using a revoke or bank keyboard file, but not using the spoofing trick. So in my earlier video, I've shown you how to get this job done via the spoofing tech. But some of you have told me that they're not able to use some of the Google apps such as the Google Play Store or the Google Pay using the spoofing trick. These apps are not working for them, although I haven't faced any issue till now. But some of you have said they are having this issue. So in this video, I'll show you how to pass a strong test using a bank keybox file, but without using the spoofing. So let's get started. First off, carry out all the requirements which are required. So in this article I've shown you, which is flashing the modules and getting the job done. So let me show you. So flash all these modules first and foremost, as you might be aware of the modules name as follows. LS4 is optional, then you need Shamiko module, plain integrity fixed or fork, Zygis assistant, and tricky store is the main part, also at the tricky store. So flash all these modules. After that, also install two more modules. One is the tricky store add-on module, which is over here. After okay, the tricky store add-on will not be shown in the list of modules. It's completely nothing to worry about. Likewise, also flash the the KC web UI app. Once you install all the apps, get a keybox file which is Calinity soft ban or reward. You could see Calinity. I'm only passing the basic and the devices. I'm, I'm not passing the strong test. So I'll show you how to pass the strong test using this trick so once you flash all these modules and install the ksu web ui app let's get started so first of get the keybox file it's the file size which i'm using is currently 12.63 kb i will link this keybox file in my article as well you may have a, a look from there so place the keybox file at data adb tricky store once you have carried out all the other tasks as shown in the this article let's now get started so first off launch the ksu web ui app from there open tricky store this will open up the tricky store add-on then open the tricky store from there now tap on the hamburger menu choose add system app and now remove the following two apps the com android gms and com android gsf the two apps are given in my article as well please remove these two apps from here first off let's remove the gms app if you close the app again open it then add system app now remove the gsf so you could now see i only have one app remaining over here if that's all well and good, then that is it. Just hit the save button. Your task has complete. You will now pass the strong test with ease. Let me show you now. This trick is quite simple. You would see we are now passing all the three tests. So you only have to remove the com Google Android GMS and com Google Android GSF from the tricky store web UI add on module. Hit the save button. And that is it. If you have any query, let me know in the comment section. And thanks for watching.